So long, in your job, you're not looking for somebody to help them into sustainable employment, which is what you're employed to do. You are suddenly looking for ways to trick your customers into be into not looking for work. And you can come up with many ways. I've seen dyslexic customers given written job searches, and when they don't produce them, what a surprise, they are sanctioned. It's just... So all around this area, the cordons are now going up. For the second night running, we've got copycat acts of violence. <laughs> You'd always be a nigger. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, That's yeah. your problem. Yeah. That's your problem. Yeah. Trying to tell me I'm racist. Trying to tell me racist comments. That's your problem. Hey, eight oh five. Yeah. I'll be back. I'm in here for five. Always be a nigger. That's what you said, yeah. I think between race and, and equality is such an important area that we need to cons cons constantly make sure that is always in in the public arena. Now with the new government in, the whole thing around race has changed completely. I don't think they've got race on the agenda whatsoever. It's been about six to eight weeks since my last entry. Since then absolutely nothing has happened, nothing has changed. Uh, obviously no job, no hope of a job, uh, nothing. Should be doing GCSEs. Are you going to say any? How can I? Do you think you'll recover from this and get back what you were before? Mm, no. No. Really? No. So you don't think you're going to get any GCSEs? No. Of course you are. Over the New Year period, I took an overdose. I just suddenly just snapped, really. I think I had a little bit of a breakdown. Um, and I can honestly say it's because of all this, everything. Um, I've got nothing to be unhappy about other than this, really. You know, my health, I can live with that. You know, I'm lucky to be here. Obviously, we haven't had time to read it yet, but as uh, David Cameron has just spoken and the message that we've had in terms of the summary of, of the report is remarkably clear that it is, it is that day of complete vindication for the families that have fought for 23 years to...